Hi, and welcome to my tutorials on Euclid's Elements, Book 1. This video presentation is going to be on Proposition 11 of Book 1, which states that if we have a straight line and any point defined on our line, it is possible to draw another line from this point such that these two angles are right angles. So before we begin, we shall refresh our memory of the definition of a right angle. If we have two lines, AB and CD, if the angles ACD and DCB are equal, then they are, by definition, a right angle. So let's start with our line AB and our point C. The first thing we're going to do is to find two points D and E so that they are both equidistant from the point C. And we do this by drawing a circle. The next thing we're going to do is draw an equilateral triangle on our line segment DE and label the vertex F. Drawing a line from F to C, we now have two right angles, FCD and FCE. So how do we go about proving this, that this is true, in fact? Well, we know that this line segment is equal to that line segment because they are the radii of the same circle. We know that this line segment is equal to that line segment because there are two sides of an equilateral triangle. So if we look at our two resulting triangles, we have R2, R1, and length FC. We have R2, R1, and length FC. And by proposition 8, we know that if we have two triangles, where all three sides are equivalent in length, the interior angles are also equal. And in this case, the angle alpha is opposite to R2, and the angle alpha is opposite to R2, and they are both the same size of angle, which, by definition, are right angles. And that is how you draw a line perpendicular to AB from a given point C. And that concludes this video presentation. To see the next presentation, just click the Next button.